How's it going, everybody? It's the man, the myth, the legend, the man, the myth, the legend. And you, you guys thought I was on repeat, but what's going on, guys? Again, it's the man, the myth, the legend, all that little jazz, and you guys know all about that. But this is going to be a little bit of a different video, and I know I say that a lot, but this probably is because this isn't Black Ops 2. This isn't just, just, it's just not Black Ops 2, guys. It's not Black Ops 2. Stop, stop yelling at me. But no, it's, it's really not Black Ops 2. This is Modern Warfare 2, and I do really enjoy Modern Warfare 2. It's probably my favorite Call of Duty. It's the Call of Duty that I started out on. I mean, of course, I'd gone over to my friends' houses and played Call of Duty 4 and World at War, but never really experienced it being able to play on Xbox Live, on the PlayStation Network, being able to actually have my own PS3 and be able to play Modern Warfare 2 on my own. I, I, I wasn't even playing online when I'd gone back to Call of Duty 4 and World at War over at my friends' houses. We would play zombies. We'd play campaign. I don't even think we knew what freaking Xbox Live was. I, I don't think we knew that you could actually play with other people that actually enjoyed playing Call of Duty that actually had the same video game as us I mean it was kind of weird it was just a completely different atmosphere four or five years ago but I do think this is a pretty solid gameplay this is completely flawless I believe we get around 40 kills so you know pretty good it's a headquarters pro on Afghan really quick one in fact we actually 200 to zero them which is pretty impressive if I do say so myself I was playing solo so I can't say we I mean of course I was on a team because that's what happens when you play public matches uh, unless you're playing a free for all or sharpshooter or something like that but we did do extremely well and the kill streaks that I was running not that they're very interesting or anything not that I'm trying to give you guys tips on a really three or four year old game now but I am using the predator missile the attack helicopter I accidentally bought the attack helicopter instead of the Harriers because if you guys don't know I started out being a ps3 player in the beginning of Modern Warfare 2 and then I kind of moved over to Xbox I still play ps3 that's where all my real life friends really play but I play on both don't get me wrong guys and I, I try and play with my subscribers the most I possibly can and if you guys want to play with me make sure to go ahead and follow me on Twitter that's where I'm gonna be most active link in the description below but while you're down there go ahead and follow me on Instagram Facebook and Twitch of course those really help me out it, it motivates me it's cool when I have more followers on Instagram it's cool when I have more likes on Facebook I mean come on guys we know everybody has a Facebook or at least most everybody does but that's besides the point I always get distracted really easily in my commentaries but I do have to say again guys I'm running the attack helicopter and the chopper gunner I would be running the attack tactical nuke and I would have probably gotten to this game but I'm not a high enough level because I'm only like level 18 or something like that and I, I, the reason I told you this is because I did pick up Modern Warfare 2 two or three days ago by the time you guys are watching this video and why I picked it up so late is because my friends are starting to get into it and starting to play it a lot more so you know I didn't want to be left out I didn't want to be the last one picked for a game of dodgeball but I thought I would just switch it up you know I like Modern Warfare 2 it's a great game you know I would say Modern Warfare 2 would be the best Call of Duty and why I'm saying it's not the best Call of Duty I I'm sure you guys know this. I'm sure you guys have seen many different commentators and Call of Duty video YouTubers say, oh my gosh, I hate the noob tubes, I hate Commando, I hate Danger Close, but all they'd have to do, all they have to do is make it so one man army doesn't resupply and make it so Danger Close isn't in the game. I, I heard one of my friends, Luke, aka Green Goblin HD, he, he said that if they just took out Danger Close and replaced it with Flak Jacket, oh my gosh, guys, he nailed it right on the head. That's exactly what I want, would want them to do if they could do it. I mean, I know they can do it, and I know it does cost a few thousand dollars to push out a patch, but don't you think we kind of deserve it? I mean, tell me down in the comment section below, what, what, what would make Modern Warfare 2 your most favorite Call of Duty? I know a lot of people in Modern Warfare 2, you don't really just casually like it. You either absolutely love the game, it's either one of your favorite Call of Duties, maybe even your most favorite Call of Duty, or you just absolutely despise it. Maybe it's your least favorite Call of Duty. I know people like Woody's Gamertag, and don't get me wrong, guys, I'm friends with Woody. He's definitely a really cool guy. But don't get me wrong, again, like I said before, I'm not trying to be mean or anything, but... He says Modern Warfare 2 was his least favorite Call of Duty. He has this burning passion to hate Modern Warfare 2. And for me, it's like, okay, man, come on. It was a good game. I, I have to say it was a good game. And people say, I mean, I, I know I'm being one of those hypocritical people going back and saying, oh my gosh, Modern Warfare 2 is the best Call of Duty ever. I don't remember the Noob Tubes or the Danger Close or the Marty Dom or the Death Streaks or anything like that. But trust me, guys, I remember them. I was playing the game. I was getting frustrated at seeing everybody running Marty Dom, everybody running Last Stand. In fact, even back in Modern Warfare 2, I mean, we haven't seen Last Stand as a perk since 
well, Black Ops 1, I guess, second chance kind of counts, but we haven't seen that perk back in the, since Black Ops 1, and it's been good, guys. I've been loving not seeing it, but now that I'm back in Modern Warfare 2, playing a little bit more of the older Call of Duties, I, I see Last Stand pop up, I see Final Stand pop up, I see Death Streaks, I see One Man Army Noob Tubes, it's like... Wow, I, I really didn't miss this stuff. I kind of like how Black Ops 2 doesn't have it. And it kind of makes me appreciate Black Ops 2. Kind of makes me see how Treyarch actually did fix some stuff in Black Ops 2. But that's just my little spiel on what I think about Modern Warfare 2. I think it's a great game. I think the maps are really well designed. They're a little bit big occasionally. Maps like Derail and maps like Underpass. But I still think it's a great map. I, uh, great map. I still think it's a great game. Hope you guys enjoyed. Remember to click like down below. Follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook all down in the description below. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. It's been Quadum FT and I'll see you next time. Caught up in the dream world, getting used to life, hanging with the wrong people can keep you from doing right. So I keep my circle tight, homie. You can never penetrate. If your mind state is just a hate, you should renovate. Do some mental funk sway. Boy, I'm hella hungry. I never play it safe like a touch base. It's enough fuck face. Open your damn eyes. Ignorance is bliss and they feeding you damn lies. I'm never giving bad vibes. Homie, you just anti-sized. Always do it.